we're looking at number three. Number three wants us to find the measure of WXY. If we look, WXY is our inscribed angle. It's inside of the circle. So that's our inscribed angle. That's what we want. And to find that, we need to know the intercepted arc, which we don't know. So we have two thirds of the circle. So really, I'll do this the long way this time, but then I'll show you the short, you can just do the calculator. 360 is what the circle equals, you know, two thirds of it. 86 plus 156 plus the arc of y, we'll call it y. So 360 being the entire circle. All right, 86 plus 56. Gives you 242. And then just subtract that by 360. Oops. If I could type it in right. 360 minus 242, get 118. So we get that as 118. And that's significant here because now we can find the measure of WXY. Again, we want to find the measure of WXY, so we're going to use this formula. Measure of WXY is equal to one half of the arc, which is WI. So we plug it in, what we know. We get our answer as 59. So if this is 118, that means this is going to be 59 degrees. And there you have it. That's number three. <clears throat> number four. Number four wants us to find RS. They want us to find RS. That's our goal. They want the measurement of RS. What we know here is we have the intercepted, or we have the inscribed angle, and we have the intercepted arc. So first, we're gonna use this relationship to get that, because we know this, we need to find this, we need two thirds of the circle to find the other missing half. So, to find RS, we need the following. 360 is equal to the measurement of TS, plus the measurement of TR and the measurement of RS. So as you can see, we have TS. We need TR, which is pink. This is our intercepted arc. Then we need RS. All right. And so the way we're going to continue with this is we need to uh, rework this formula. We're finding RS, so our formula would be 360 minus the measurement of TS minus the measurement of TR equals the measurement of RS. So this is what we're solving for. This is what we need to find and one gravy. All right, so we need to find this. So I'm gonna do that over here and then we'll finish this up over here. This is just showing it algebraically of what we're doing. <coughs> All right, so from here, we're going to do uh, the inscribed angle formula, which is the measurement of, no, uh, of TR is equal to two times TSR. 
Okay, we're gonna plug it in. Again, I'll just highlight it one more time. I know I'm going extra long with this, just wanna emphasize what our thought process is. So two times 42, two times 42 gets you 84. So the measurement of TR is 84 degrees. So we have everything we need. So in your calculator, you could just do 360 minus TS, which is 171 minus 84, which would get you the measure of RS. Remember, that's our goal of this problem. 360 minus 171 minus 84, you get 105 degrees equals the measure of RS. And that's it. That's how you do number four. Remember, I did it a little longer. You could do it much shorter if you just do a little bit of shortcuts.